what's up youtube okay so today you guys i am giving you guys a shaping video um right now i'm about to apply the tips and then she wants coffin she wants coffin all white acrylic nails so i am going to be um i think i yes i already prepped her nails now i'm just applying the tips but this is just a, sh a shaping video so i'm not going to show everything i'm just going to show where i'll be shaping and um drilling and how i get my shape and stuff but i'm applying the tips and then i'm going to um what do i do remove the shine some more so i can rough it up the nail base because i don't have any more um rough sanding bits so now oh but i'm going to be cutting into coffin i already have coffin tips but i want to show you guys how i actually get my coffin so i'm not going to take the easy way out this time Also, you guys, I'm still learning new things about YouTube and stuff. So I want you guys to bear with me as I, you know, figure it out along the way. But I will still be posting and showing you guys how I do certain things. Also, you guys, these tips are the EC basket tips from Amazon. All you have to do is look up the EC basket tips on Amazon and you will find those or you can find the coffin shape um, to fight those. But those are what I use when they want maybe square nails or something. But here I am cutting the sides of the um, tips so I can get a nice coffin shape. And then after that, I'll just be fouling. I'll just be fouling to a perfect coffin shape. When I um foul, I don't, with the tips, I don't fully foul the shape until I got acrylic on it. So when acrylic get on the nails, that's when I go full force with the shape because there's no need to fully shape when, you know, I have to do it twice.
For my nail files, I use 8080 nail grits. Um, they are really sharp, so I advise you to start off with 8100, but you can you can start off with 8080, but they're really sharp and it's easy to cut somebody. So you don't want to cut your clients. Yeah, just start off with 100, 100, or 180. Okay, so now I'm going to be skipping right into the acrylic. I didn't um, show you guys when I laid the acrylic because it's only a shaping video. It is only a shaping video. So when I'm shaping the acrylic, that's when I really go to work. Like, you can really tell. But pay attention. I don't know if you guys can already tell the difference between the nail I just did and the nail that I'm doing now, but look at the shape. Like, just look at it. You can tell it's a big difference. Like, shaping is the most important part about doing nails. Like, to me, shaping is everything. Your shape has to be right. With me, I always file the the tip of this um of the nails last. Like I turn the hand and I file the tip of the nails last, so I can see from their side. Like if they see a mistake, I can also also see it too. So that's why I file from their side when I turn the hand around. Also, when I do a shape, I also go and shape with the drill too. Like when I'm filing. I try and get this shape perfect with the drill also. You'll see that when I get to it.
as you can see when I go down the sides and stuff like um when I go down the sides I kind of like sharpen up the shape as you can see right here I'm trying to sharpen up the shape a little bit more like I try to make my shape perfect I like for my shape to be perfect
if this video was any help to you guys let me know i will do another one also i will keep doing shaping videos so i can update you guys on new things i might do with shaping but if there was any help let me know comment like and subscribe um hit me up in the dms i will get back with you guys i have a lot of people hit me up so it's hard to get back with you guys but here is the finished product Thank mm -hmm. you.